Hey guys, Coral Blonde Wave, I'm Eric. I'm Calvin. Aaron. And we're back with It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Last time, flip, 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 flip Philadelphia. 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 Remember, Aaron? Remember? I am absolutely Dennis Reynolds. Denise Reynolds? This picture looks nothing like you. Oh, Dennis. Well, thank you. Because what is he doing? What are you going to do? Pounds of solid I thought he had like someone else's thing. I forgot bro. Dennis's name. It's actually Reynolds. a testament to your gym. Well, I'm going to need you to either buy your own membership or get out. Mac? Yeah. Hey, Tranny, Carbon, sorry. How you doing? Wow, you look great. Sweet camel toe. That's a good tuck job. You have a tape back there? It, it, no. It's good. It, it, it's actually gone. <laughs> I, I had the surgery. Get out. That's fantastic. Well, I thought I was going to get a phone call after the old snip snip because we talked about that. But either way, now that you're dickless, I'm into it. <laughs> what are you doing this afternoon? How's it going? Uh, it's going good, pal, but, uh, the lady isn't interested. Uh, Mac, I would like you to meet my husband, Nick. Mmm. Husband. Didn't get a call, huh? You're married. <laughs> Great. Gosh. <laughs> That's that title turn. <laughs> such a great. <laughs> such a harsh <laughs> stance. <laughs> To take on that cut. <laughs> oh, he's a harsh man. Oh. <laughs> I know. I think that he's going to take this, uh, well. Right? Well. I ran into the tranny. She got her dick cut off, and she married a dude. Oh, that's oh. great. Congratulations to her. No, that is not great. No? That is a gay marriage. Uh, I got a question for you. One's a girl, one's a guy. Yeah. And how is that gay? Well, for starters, clearly her husband is a homosexual, okay? Why are you making that assumption? Because he's with the tranny? You were with the you tranny. You were with the what tranny. No, Charlie, that is completely different, and you know it. Yeah, no, he's right. Why That's is it different? Because this new guy, if I'm hearing correctly, he waited until she got her dick cut off before he banged her. But that means... No, but, that means well, hey, that Max gay? Gays want to be miserable like everybody else and get married. Let him do it. No skin off my ass. No, marriage is a wonderful thing See? between two people who decide they want to spend the rest of their lives together because they love each other very much. I'm all for it, and I think everyone should be entitled to it. Oh, oh, everybody up on their high horse of marriage all of a sudden. Marriage is about procreation, okay? This is gay marriage. That's two dudes banging each other. What do you get from that? Nothing. Nothing. Uh, that is a you can just be jealous, argument. Mac. You just say you're jealous. <laughs> He's so jealous. Straight to the Supreme Court. Mm -hmm. They'll love it there. They'll, Run that right up the ladder, right? Run it up the ladder. Right <laughs> right <there. laughs> oh, I think you're just getting upset that the tranny married some guy that's not you, and that's what this is about. Yeah. So, Thank you, so, Charlie. This is about the big man upstairs, okay? Getting boxed out. Uh, getting boxed out. It says in the Bible that gay marriage is wrong, okay? And I'm going to show you. Where's our Bible? Where's our Bible? Where's our goddamn Bible? We don't have a Bible in here. Why don't we have a Bible? We never have. It's a bar. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Frank. <laughs> I don't have enough facts to support my argument. Clearly. But I'm going to Bible. And then I'm going to come back and I'm going to school you sons of bitches, okay? Because you guys are trying to confuse me. You're trying to confuse me because that's what God's work. What? What? Uh, what? Uh. That's what God's work. He's getting himself all worked up, huh? Yeah, very worked up, very worked up. You know, I always thought I'd be married by now. What? Yeah, well, I don't know. I, all that talk about marriage and everything's got me thinking about myself and, and my situation, and I guess I always thought I'd be married by now. Everyone what looks like you two about? years older. Frank, mm -hmm. I'm talking Was about there Maureen like a pause? Um, Maybe. God, dude, don't start. But also HD and the rest of the Yeah, that great. too. We were so in love. God, you remember Maureen Ponderosa, right, Charlie? I remember her dead Maureen. tooth, dude. What? Dead tooth? She didn't have a dead tooth. You guys remember her brother, Bill? Bill Ponderosa? Oh, that guy was like a walking cliche. He was hot. Great buns. Yeah, and I remember every time you tried to talk to him, you would die. I'm I got a little gaggy. It's only really because he made me nervous, but he was he was very handsome. What is with you two and the Ponderosas? I think I might call her up, actually. What was her name Marie? Marine. Marine. Marine Ponderosa. Put him in the closet. Tuck him in the back. Oh, All right. yeah. Got him. Here you go. Come on. You Coins. No! Oh, you dumped the whole box. Look at this. I've been saving these for years. What? I think I slipped a disc, man. Damn. 
stand straight with something. Ah, oh, Frank, I gotta go see your chiropractor again. Oh, right. I just keep paying medical bills, right? Is that it? Oh, I Come keep talking pennies. You're in pain? Yeah, let me hit you with the two by four. You don't feel anything. No, I don't want to play that game anymore. All right, crap. Want to play, play that game anymore? Let me hit you with the two by four. It's <laughs> Oh, oh fuck. <laughs> they just keep hurting and bettering each other. <laughs> this is ridiculous. They're both in nasty old long underwear. This is gonna sound crazy. I just got an idea. If we do that domestic partnership thing that gay guys can do, I can totally get on your health insurance. You wouldn't have to pay for the chiropractor. You proposing to me? Come on, man. No, I'm saying we're already friends, right? Oh, let's be friends with benefits, right? Oh, yeah. You get your back six. What's in it for me? All right, man. There's got to be a reason why all those couples want to do it, right? Uh, perks, right? Can we at least Tax. Get into Yeah, I was going to say, you, you have a dependent now. Really all right, all right, look into it. I mean, I <laughs> Look into it. Before. I got too much pain. It's bad on me. Oh, I'm bad. Right, you gotta hit me with the two. <laughs> what? Well, I'm still playing that game. How's the two have more help? I feel really nervous, D. I'm Are they meeting both of the Ponderosas? Close to 15 years. I was really in love with that girl. Yeah. Oh, Maureen? Uh, not really Maureen? Nice. Yeah, not like having to do with ships and the water. I said Maureen. I thought he said Maureen. <laughs> She gagging already? Maybe bubbly water? Maybe you can get it. Maybe so far. Hey, Maureen. Wow. Hi. Look at you. you look amazing. You look amazing. <laughs> Who's this? Is this your husband? Oh, no. This is Bill. Hey, guys. Bill? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. What's wow. the other guy? Sheldon's dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. He's right? very young there. I would there. not have guessed that was you. Yeah, I gave him a little weight. Did you now? Oh, well, no. It's hardly noticeable. Hardly noticeable. I do notice the ring, though. Oh, good for you. You yeah. got married. Yeah, well, that's 10 years good. now. Yeah, she's amazing. So are my two kids. Oh. I don't want to say a little bit. No, 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 no. I don't, I don't really. I mean, it's great, but you know what I mean. Nobody really wants to see that. God damn, this has been a really fun walk down memory lane. Uh, Maureen, great to see you. And Bill, take care She's of yourself. She's just bailing. Hi. Whatever. Hey, D. We'll say. Okay, mm -hmm. excuse me. All right. Well, uh, yeah, well, this has uh, got to be a little bit awkward for you now, Bill, right? Because you're here and we're sort of having a, you know, probably going to have a little sit-down breakfast. Oh. And now you're a bit of a third wheel, kind of worms your way into our situation. Yeah, not really. You know, I just came to catch up. So. No. 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 Yeah. Yeah, that would be great. That would be great. Yeah, take, take care of As if he didn't think of it. Oh, yeah. Bye, Bill. She didn't care. No, yeah. Hey, you want to sit down? Yeah. Great. Hey. Man, Maureen Ponderosa. I can't even believe those words are coming out of my mouth. Well, it's... Look at you. Look at you. You look great. You're still quite a catch. You look just like you did in high school. Oh. Hey. Do you remember all the good times that we used to have in the back of your dad's Dawson behind this place? Oh, man. So much romance. That's why you came here. Hey, how was your dad? Dad died last year. He died? Yeah. Oh, that's, that's too bad. It happens. You know, he was getting up there, right? It's probably natural causes or... Suicide? Su suicide. Car exhaust, yeah. I had to uh, break the window of the Dotsons. Oh, yeah. Dotsons. Of the Dotsons. Yeah. His eyes were so yellow. Okay. Oh, well, Maureen Ponderosa. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that is Charles Maureen Her face Ponderosa. during that. I know. Oh. Uh, together again at last. Uh, I can break the window of the dots. His eyes were so yellow. Hey, Carmen. Carmen, hey. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my God. Hey, Yeah. What's going on? Oh, good. I'm glad you're here, too. Okay, because it's crazy <sighs> both of you guys. I am about to do you guys a huge solid. Does Nick Ready? know? You think Nick knows? Men with men committing indecent acts, sex in the butt, will receive the due penalty for their perversion. <laughs> Word of the Lord. Okay, what is it you're trying to say, Mac? I'm saying that in the eyes of the Lord, your marriage is an abomination, and if you don't get a divorce, you're going to hell. <sighs> You know, I love people tripping all the time. Can I see that for a second? Yeah, but I'm not tripping. Bam! Okay. It's all right <laughs> just, yeah, just, just going to rip it in half. That book is long as shit. Oh, yeah, I like this one. Yeah. Exodus 21, verses 20 and 21. Mm -hmm. When a man strikes his slave with a rod so hard that the slave dies, he shall be punished. 
If, however, the slave survives for a day or two, he is not to be punished for the slave is his property. That's that's not what I'm talking about, though. That's a different... That's not my thing. That's not oh, my so you saying you're going to whoop my black ass with a rod for as long as you like, and as long as I get up after a day or two, we all good. That's what you're telling me? No, I wouldn't whoop on you uh, with anything, whether you were my slave or not. It's just... That doesn't really pertain anyway, because oh, that section sure. is not from the same time. Oh, oh, really? Well, what time's your section from, Matt? Mm -hmm. Look, I came here to help you guys, okay? And as a gay man, there's certain things you need to know about the afterlife. I'm not a gay man. Yes, you are. You're banging a dude. Look, if anything, you're the one that slept with me when I was a man. Oh, that's it. You gay. No, 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 <laughs> no, no, no. If this no, is about no, you and no, me, no. then just say that. I'm never going to admit that. He <laughs> <laughs> just comes right out and says it. Man. You're calling me gay, telling me I'm tripping, and trying to confuse me with your liberal biblicisms. Man, my guess is you've been confused for a very long time. <laughs> I'm not gonna admit that. I'm not gonna admit that. <laughs> I will never admit that. I want to use that on something. Now you're definitely gonna have another massive heart attack or stroke in the next few years, right? Definitely. All right. Well, what's gonna happen when you go on life support, dude? Dennis and Dee are gonna pull the plug on you so fast your head is gonna spin. But think about this, Frank. You know who's not gonna do that? This guy, right here. This thing. This is so much complicated wow. stuff, Charlie. Look who it is. Wow. I think I'll get married. Maureen Ponderosa, right? Charlie. Ooh. Hey, Maureen, how are you? Dead tooth. Let me see the dead oh, tooth. Let's see. Talk the, you. Oh, there's a, there's a, oh, pipe down, Frank. Pipe down. So um, listen, guys, we just got married. What? Yeah. Oh, there yeah, he did it. Married. Yep. Maureen and I got married. What is wrong with you? That's not what's wrong with me, Frank. It's what's right with me, and that's this little piece of paper right here that we just signed. It's our marriage certificate. Now we're married. Boom. That's Boom. not what that is. Just had to sign a little piece of paper. They gave Frank and I like a million floors for our marriage. Hey, oh, you guys are trying to get married too. Wait, so huh? what did he get? Weird. Oh, okay. Well, uh, we're out of here. So. What? They're married. That's a civil union. Take them a lot more. Are you kidding me? I'm having feelings again. Dude, like like some kind of 14 year old kid or something. I mean, you remember feelings, right? I remember feelings. You remember feelings. feelings. I have feelings every single day of my life. Did Did Dennis not have feelings? <laughs> oh, he's a fucking psychopath. <laughs> a shell around myself. A cold, calculated, heartless shell that couldn't be broken by anything but marriage. And that's what she did, dude. She broke that shell with marriage. In a good way, if I'm being unclear. And that brings me actually to my next point. Mm. I need you to move out. Mm. Like now, like right away. What, what am I going to do with all my stuff? You know what? Believe it or not, I've been doing some inventory, and it turns out you don't actually own anything in this world. <laughs> what? It can't be true. It's shockingly true. Yeah. Yeah. Every single thing in here is mine. For instance, that shirt that you're wearing right now. That was my shirt. And then I got tired of it, I threw it in the trash, and then you fished it out of the trash, and you cut the sleeves off of it, as you are wont to do. Because that's your thing, but whatever. Um, also, listen, I don't want to rush you on this either, but I did have to drop you from my cell phone's family plan. Oh, and I'm going to need you to stop using my name at the gym, because I'm getting a lot of phone calls about that, and that's a little embarrassing. Can I say something? Yeah, good? totally. <laughs> he just kicked him out. Kicked him out. He let him... I mean, I guess if everything's his, I don't... I oh wouldn't necessarily. I don't want to go back here anymore. Here we go. Oh. Hey. Oh, How did you do this it? This is gonna be. No, 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 no. Good question. Yeah, I'm kind of in the middle of something right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's easy. Okay, no problem. That's better. Thank you people keep bothering me at the gym. I'm so sorry. It's gonna be a quick question, Charlie. You remember me, right? The yeah. The answer thing, and I. Uh, look, no, I don't. My friend and I were trying to get like a gay marriage situation going on, and he's all tripped up about some issue, and now he's uncomfortable talking to me. I figured you're an expert, so we could talk to you. All right, fine. Just go ahead. What? Good. Go. If Charlie and I were gonna get married, who would be the man and who would be the woman in that situation? Neither of you would be the woman. You're both men. Are you kidding me? Is, is this what you've been upset about the whole time? Which one of us is going to be the woman? Yeah! I'm not going to get my dick cut off and sold to China, spend the rest of my life on a treadmill like this Why guy. would China buy Please, it? Please, what? What? Why don't I want to be the woman, Charlie, and I don't want to see you be the woman. That's insane. Neither of us would be the woman, dude. We would both be men. We'd be two cool, straight dudes married together. Ooh. Well, I never thought of it that way. <laughs> 
When two dudes get married, that doesn't seem very gay. Yeah, right? <laughs> 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 I love Frank. He's so dumb and happy. Dudes. 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 I'm down with that. All right. Pump you're it, gay. Pump it. Gay is married. Is my role this time now? Uh, any more questions? No. I think I got it. Hey, did they really sell your dick to China? <laughs> No, I can tell by how you're staring. The answer is no. I told you, Frank. That's crazy. I told you, Frank. That's crazy. Two dudes married together. That, that was an old establishing cool. shot. D, hey, we gotta talk. Wait, you can't just come barging in here like that. What are you doing? Two beers. It takes a Bills big hand to admit defeat, Isn't but it? you were right. I was wrong. What would she do? She's married. She got jealous. They want, which got me thinking about you. I don't know. Oh no, I'm not. Or gonna she's just having two. Glad you asked. I'm moving in. Also, I need to get on your gym membership because I gotta get back in there ASAP before I lose this pump. What's with the beer? Is he carboloading? No. Oh. Mm -hmm. Are you gonna throw up? No. Then why are you gagging? <coughs> oh, that because D that triggers my gag reflex too, and then I feel yeah. like I'm gonna throw up. Yeah, it's fine. I had some bad spaghetti. Just spaghetti. Oh God. <clears throat> oh D. Look, the point is the reason I came over here is because you were totally right about this marriage thing. Okay. It is a special bond between two people in love. And everybody deserves that, that right. Uh, look, I'm thinking that... <laughs> yeah. No, 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 not in there. <sighs> oh, sorry. Uh, wait, I know you. <laughs> no, I do God, I She's, hate her gag, She so. sees him hot again, which she did before or something. Or she's just that desperate. It's the wife. I think it's the marriage thing in it. Like, she's like, someone wants him, I want him, I want to stop that. We've got all the Lethal Weapon movies, which is cool, including the one that I made with the guys, Lethal Weapon 5. Yes, amazing film, truly, truly. Although, I guess a little confusing halfway through because Mac and I decided to switch parts. He wanted to play Murtaugh for some reason. Yeah, and I'm not going to lie, his use of blackface I found a bit regrettable, but... <coughs> Come on, it's our first night as a married couple. I want to spend it with my husband. Oh, yeah. See that you're wearing another one of those uh, Kit Kat sweatshirts that <laughs> seem so fun. <laughs> you glued some uh, some jewels and some flowers and things to it. Ah, uh, interesting. I like to be comfy and current. Yeah, yeah. I did not remember that about you. You don't remember a lot of things, silly. Yeah. Now you get yourself on that couch. I'm gonna go make us fish sticks. Ah, uh, uh, we have any fish sticks? I bought some. She whispers she it. Like fish sticks, but... Dennis, mm -hmm. hey, I love you. Is he seeing the dead tooth or whatever? What, what dead tooth? <clears throat> There's one tooth that was just different. Yeah, it was black. She smiled with every tooth in her mouth. What? <laughs> <laughs> The regret. <laughs> Wait, that's it? That's it. That. All right. Well, do we? Okay. Dennis is married. This doesn't feel like a the status quo didn't change. I feel like I need another. It didn't even say to be continued. <laughs> you know, like. Are you thinking we're gonna come back and Dennis is not married? I, I mean, that's typically. Or he what kills happen, her, right? Yeah, but... typically. But it's a show. Or he kills her. <laughs> That's what I will do, I guess. Remember when you used to have feelings? <coughs> yeah, right? Yeah, I have feelings every day, dude. Yeah. Dude, I'm like 14 again. Like, I have feelings again. Like, you haven't had feelings since you were 14? Like, what do you mean? We done knew Ugh. that he didn't have I'd love anything. that in this episode. He just completely... He gets so insecure and just falls back on his Catholicism. Gosh, yeah. <laughs> And then it's like and he well, never well, deals with his Catholicism until stuff like that. I'm not really talking about that verse. I'm yeah. talking about this verse. Yeah. yeah, that was made at a different time. Uh -huh. Like, all right, we'll Ugh. pick and choose which parts we want to talk about here. Yeah. Well, are we gonna like? What about the Charlie Frank thing? Mm -hmm. Like, it's not like they were gonna get married, but then that just—I feel like there should have been a to be continued here. Yeah. <laughs> like that's how I feel. Sure. Hmm. And then Dee's thing, I figure was like she was expecting however she had him pictured from before and he came in having gained weight and then she was like, nah. Mm -hmm. 
And then I imagine the idea of, like, well, he's married. Mm -hmm. Like, someone has him. So he can't be with me. Yeah. And so now I, I'm being told I can't have something, which makes me want it more. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Like, it's kind of... the throwing up. And it's the, it's the, the boyfriend effect, right? Like, because someone else finds him desirable... There must be something desirable about him. Now I find him desirable. Yeah. Kind of thing. I feel like she would be the person to do that kind of thing. Even if she's like, oh, no, he's not attractive at all anymore. And then be like, but I can't have him. I'll get him now. And yeah. then, But she was also gagging, so there must have been Well, something. it's because she Maybe, finds him, know. what, like, so attractive that she gets nervous? It used to be that. It's the same reason and she used to get nervous now it's doing, just like a, doing comedy. Now it's just like a response. She was gagging. Like a trained action. response now. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. Now this episode has like these two people who are married who seem fine and then everyone else around them is doing marriage for like all the wrong reasons it looks like and like Mac doesn't target any of those. You know what I mean? Like it's... Yeah, no. Like this guy's married with two kids yeah. but now he's hooking up with D. Mac. You know, these yeah. two are trying to get married just for the benefits, not because they care about each other at all. Mm -hmm. These two are married, but like this this person used to be a guy, yeah. and that's the problem. And it's really just Max jealous. Mm -hmm. But like they seem to just be together. And he also can't happy. deal with his own feelings of latent homosexuality. Sure. I, I love in the bar when they're like, wait, but you didn't wait until uh -huh. there was no dick, so then you're gay, right? Like, no, no, no. <laughs> you know, he's like freaking it's out like, about it. Yeah. <laughs> it's like. Wait, if that guy is gay now for having sex with a woman, then you are definitely gay. <laughs> yeah, right? And he's like, no, no, that's, it's not like that. You know it's not like that. And yeah. It's like, mm. oh, it's so like just say your... I love the thing. He's like, if this is about us, just say it's about us. I'm, I will never admit that. <laughs> I will never admit that. <laughs> so funny. Uh, so good. It's just... It's such fun... Me writing, I guess. It's, yeah. it's so cringy. No, yeah, it's super but cringy. It's, but that's the point. Like, it's how far can we take these characters and shake them to their foundation? And will they so... shake first? But, like, it's a thing where, like, you look at Mac and you're like, clearly he's in the wrong. Yeah. Right? Yeah. But, but then, he believes so but, firmly that he's in the right. Sure. But then there's also people who will do that exact thing. Oh, yeah. But it's for the reasons of their belief. He's just using the reasons of that belief. A lot in the of favor people, of what he wants it to be because he's you know, jealous of Carmen. Sure. A lot of people do that. They they find a belief or a system that supports their intentions and then they use that as the use that as like the rule to reinforce their intentions and yeah. then try and force you to conform to those. Yeah. Right. Generally, the yeah. Generally, they'll cherry pick beliefs they already have. Yeah. Generally, you know, because you're generally born into that type of belief, uh, especially when it comes to religion. It has a lot to do with your geography, not necessarily the things that you've been convinced of. Mm -hmm. But yeah, he just, I, I, I love that scene. I love that he's like, I refuse to admit that. I never, I never thought of that one scene taking place in a subway, but it does take place in a subway. Yeah, yeah. In a subway. Yeah, subway has a reputation what? of coming in and being a sponsor for certain shows. Sure. Yeah, I don't know if it has any relation to that or not. It has to uh, because they were inside and there was a subway sticker on the window facing the camera, which it and never they, faces. It never the faces inside. It never faces, faces outside. Yeah. So it had to be like, no, get subway in here. It wasn't an accident, you know. Yeah, it seemed purposed. Yeah. I thought it was man, it's good. So yeah, did they? Did they save, quote-unquote, this show like they saved so many others? Like I don't believe Chuck so. and Community? And not, I don't think so, but, I mean, it, the show has so many seasons. I don't know the, Cause the story in between all definitely got some budget here. Yeah. They refilmed their intro. They have HD cameras. It's always sunny in Philadelphia. Grows and evolves with television sure. throughout these 15, 16 years, you know? Mm. I mean, here... It doesn't seem like it to us, but here, this is a very, very, very fresh subject in the Supreme Court mm -hmm. while this happened. And I think it was oh, yeah. in the summer, you know? Dude, this, mm -hmm. Look, so, no, this isn't natural when he's taking the... the yeah. The, oh, yeah, that's a very... <laughs> so I, I love that they're making this episode in a time where not just, uh, you know, it's very fresh on people's mind, but a lot of people watching the show believe exactly what Mac believes. Sure. And they're mocking those people mm -hmm. <laughs> by putting it like this, you know?
This is about I, you and me. I will never admit that. <laughs> I love uh, I love Frank's one comment because like at the very least, I feel like that's the way you can go. Like his thing is he's so bitter, yeah. but he's like. Let let gay people get married and be just as miserable as the rest of us. Yeah, yeah. like no skin off my ass. Yeah, <laughs> he's like it doesn't affect me at all. It doesn't matter. Yeah, and you know, for him especially, marriage has not been a happy thing, right? So like, let them also be miserable. Like, yeah. what's it? What's it matter? It's not like all. It wasn't happy for him. Which time? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> but it's not like all oh, because now there's gay marriage. Now I must be gay married. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so, and, him and Charlie. It's like just two dudes married. That doesn't yeah, sound gay dudes. at all. <laughs> that sounds two great. straight dudes. Yeah, <laughs> I love it's like the, the uh, straightest thing you can do. <laughs> I love Max frantically looking for a Bible. Where's our Bible? It's a bar. It's a bar. We've never had a Bible. <laughs> uh, I love that he comes with like the red, uh, like dented. Bible too, like it looks like the one that you would get off the back of a pew, like as a catechism or something. Oh. I don't know where he found it. Like but. he took it from the back of the yeah. back of a pew from yeah. a Catholic church. Yeah, or something? maybe. <laughs> it looked like uh, almost like a songbook because mm -hmm. it I had the was, like the red. I stole from hotel sure. stained yeah. pages. Now generally, I mean, it's different in different oh. places, but all the Catholic churches I've ever been to, they don't actually have Bibles there. They'll just have like. Readings like an excerpt from mm -hmm. the, the letter of from John to the Corinthians or something like that, and you'll just read a little bit because it used to be that you were not allowed to read the Bible. Well, you yeah. could only be told what the Bible said by your priest. That's why it was in Latin, yeah. and priests were were taught Latin yeah. to read it to the masses, mm -hmm. and you know regular people couldn't learn Latin because that was. Very difficult and expensive. So that's where you have Martin Luther and the breaking of the church and the Protestant. Mm -hmm. Catholic. Sounds a lot like that. Like I found this book in the Bible or a book in the ground and no one can read it but me, and now I lost it. Sorry. <laughs> like, like yeah. it's, a little bit. It's like sorry. We'll tell you what it says and what you need to believe. Like you don't get to deter determine that for yourself. Yep. Yep. <clears throat> Calvin, you, we're gonna. You did it. Oh, and then, oh, sorry. My hotel in New York. Uh, this. Two weeks ago, uh -huh. right? Yes. Yes. Two weeks ago, uh, did not have a Gideon's Bible in it. The Gideon's failed you. Well. Someone probably stole it. I never used a Bible in a hotel room anyway. Yeah. I never understood why they were there. Well, it was Gideon's paid for it. Yeah. What? If you were trying to spread the message and you want to people like, to be before the internet... Alone in a hotel room hunting a deal. It's like, oh, what is there to read? Oh, the Bible. And it was a way of spreading their ministry. Mm -hmm. The Gideons. You should do have other religions. They well, should. that this is America, and we only have, we only care about one. What? No. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's how it works. Just put like, yeah, I, I just, because they've lobbied so yeah. much in our political system <laughs> that they've made it very difficult. So, what do you guys think of uh, Maureen uh, Hunterissa? She's a, one of our new characters. She now. seems, she seems nice. like a very sweet person. Yeah. Cat sweaters. Feel bad yeah. for her and her and with her dad. That she her. will be eaten alive by Dennis and his manipulative, psychopathic Does Does she have ways. cats? Like, she has cat sweaters, and she bought fish sticks. Does she have cats, and are they going to be moving in? Like, D had a problem with cats, remember? Like, well, if they are, there's a lot of room now, because Max has gone. Because he didn't own anything. Like, none of this is actually yours. Shockingly. Does that include his bedroom? <laughs> that's, I don't, like, maybe Mac, <laughs> did Mac get this, or uh, Mac moved in while Dennis had this, and Dennis just had, like, a guest room already set up, or, like, uh, I don't know. Well, or what might have happened, I can see yeah, this. Maybe. Dennis got a new bed. Mm-hmm. So then his old bed went to Mac. That's true. Could've Just happened. like the shirt did, right? All we know is that Mac's name is not on the lease because he thought it was dumb. Yeah. Thought it was dumb. Mm -hmm. Well, his credit was bad, right? Yeah, that's what he said. Yeah, his credit, credit that's right. I love, I love the, uh, give me that two by four. I'm in so much pain. <laughs> like, what? I don't want to play that game. That scene was so funny. <laughs> And I love, like, uh, what it seemed like was like they were helping each other's back, yeah. but then the other one was hurting their back yes. in the process. So it was like a... When you help, you hurt. Ah, yeah. It's a vicious circle of, and now a civil union. What were they going to do with all those coins? He was going to put them in the, in the other room, the closet, or something. Take them to the Coinstar thing or whatever. But they were all pennies. Coinstar 
It would take Man, I miss hours to do that. Many I miss the one we had at, at our bank. So heavy. I miss the one at our bank. Like it used to be that I think they took it out, but it used to be like if you had an account yes. at People's Bank, yeah, you could just deposit you just the go, coins. Just put the coins yeah. there, and you dig it, and you put it. They in have one account. there now. A new one. Do they? Yeah. They, I know it was in, gone. In which which the, the branch? Putnam. The main branch. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's the only one. Is that it I knew in the it. ATM? No, it's like up, when you go up the escalator. Up the escalator to the left. Up the right escalator. There, it's, it's now there too, but it's like not on the wall in the corner. It's like beside the the cabinet. So no one cares about this. But so yeah, what do you? Yeah. Do they like give you cash like the machine at Walmart, or do they give you like you can deposit all this money and there's no fee? They give kind you of cash. Thing. You you put it in there. It gives you a receipt. You take it to the desk and they give you that in cash. Huh. As as it's so much account. better than the one at Walmart yeah. that takes a fee for well, giving you cash. it's as long as you have an account there. You have to have an account. Yeah. If you don't have an account there, then they give well, you a yeah, ticket sure. and you pay a fee. Yep. Yeah. So now that we've solved that and you guys cared. I don't have an account at Walmart. You're welcome. <sighs> Actually, no, I do. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. We are in Season 6. Um, and over at BlindWave.com, we're actually up to Episode 5 of Season 6. So if you want to check those out right now, support us at BlindWave.com. Walmart Plus, you get free deliveries. Walmart Plus?